hey guys welcome back to the channel today's topic is one that has been troubling a lot of people in ghana recently i'm talking about the rise of whatsapp account hacks yeah it's getting crazy out there your whatsapp can be hijacked anytime even if you have two-factor authentication on in this video i'm breaking down how these processes are doing it and more importantly how you can protect yourself let's dive into the details So, the fraudsters are really stepping up their game. Back in the day, they used to trick people by pretending to be a group admin or a member of a WhatsApp group. They would make up some story like, hey, can you give me your two-factor authentication? Is it authentication or authentic authentication so that I can activate you in the group or some other silly excuse? And sadly, a lot of people fell for it. Now though, they have moved on to something more complex. What they do now is super sneaky. They will divert your calls and SMS to a different number without you knowing. And once that is done, they will attempt to log into your WhatsApp account. But here is the twist. You won't get the verification code like you usually would because it is going straight to them. So what happens next? Well, when you open your WhatsApp, it will ask for your two-step verification pin to confirm a login on another device. If you don't realize what is going on and enter that pin, you are in big trouble. You will be logged out of WhatsApp and the scammers would take over your WhatsApp account. Most people panic when they can't access your WhatsApp anymore. Meanwhile, these scammers are busily using your account to scam your contacts or do even worse. Okay, so here is something super important. Do you know that you can actually check if your calls or SMS have been diverted? This is a hidden trick not many people know, but as usual, I'm here to give you the gist. It's very, very simple. Now, for call diversions, to check if your calls have been diverted, all you need to do is to dial star hash 21 hash, and this code will tell you if your calls are being forwarded to another number for sms diversions you dial star hash says to hash and this will tell you if your messages are being forwarded now after you check for this and you want to cancel assuming you realize that your calls or sms might have been diverted to cancel any diversions you dial hash hash 002 hash and this will cancel all call and sms diversions on your line so if you see anything suspicious, use this code immediately to cut them off. Now that you know how they are hacking people, let's talk about the steps you can take to protect yourself. Trust me, this will save you a lot of headache. Number one is to never share your two-step verification pin. I know this might sound obvious, but take it serious. Never share your two-step verification pin as no legit administrator or contact would ever ask you for your two-step verification or whatsapp pin keep it private number two is to check your link devices regularly go to link devices in whatsapp settings if you see any device you do not recognize tap on it and log out immediately as soon as possible third is to use a strong two-step verification pin do not use something simple like one two three four five six which would be very very obvious to guess create a strong and unique pin that will make it very difficult for other people to guess if they try hacking into your account also be careful with the two-step verification prompts i know two-step verification is something that is helping us to protect our accounts but now these hackers are using it as a tool whenever your whatsapp prompts you to enter your two-step verification pin that is where you need to be very very diligent whenever whatsapp asks for your two-step verification pin read the prompt carefully take your time to make sure it's legit before you enter anything and number five add an email recovery to your account this one is a must for everyone Adding a recovery email makes it much easier to regain access to your account if you ever lose it. Here is how to do it. Open WhatsApp, go to settings, 
tap on account and then two step verification choose add email address enter a valid email address and confirm it now if you ever forget your two step verification pin or get logged out whatsapp would send you a recovery email to reset it super helpful right six is to watch for any suspicious activity if you're not receiving calls or sms check for diversions immediately using the codes that i have mentioned earlier okay let's say worst case scenario you've already been hacked what do you do first don't panic these are the steps you can take to recover your account number one is to log out of all devices that is if you still have access to your whatsapp on other devices go to link devices and log out from all other sessions Two is to contact WhatsApp support. Send an email to WhatsApp at support at whatsapp.com, which I'll leave a link to it in the description, explaining the situation in detail. They will help you temporarily deactivate your account and the hacker cannot use it. Now, the third step is to reactivate your account after 24 hours. Once your account is deactivated, wait for 24 hours, then log back in with your phone number make sure to set up a stronger two-step verification pin when you're finally back remember prevention is the best way to protect yourself make sure you're following these steps and keeping an eye for anything suspicious and don't forget those ussd codes to check for all calls and sms diversions they could save you a lot of trouble that's it for today's video i hope this was helpful and keeps your whatsapp safe from hackers if you found this useful please hit that like button subscribe to this channel and put us on post notifications so that whenever we post new and helpful content like this you'll be notified and share this video with your friends and family so that they can also protect themselves too stay safe out there and i'll see you in the next one ciao